Ladies and gentlemen, another classic case of psychological rape, mental torture, piracy on our streets by the local councils and Transport for London. Transport for London PLC. As you can see, what they're asking for is £404 for traffic contravention. We can only thank Tony Blair and his kind government for transferring the rules and regulations to the local authority. We can only thank him for going into Iraq and we can only thank him for now being the peace ambassador earning millions of pounds each year. And now he wants to convert his religion. What a waste of time, what a waste of effort, what a waste of money. And they want us to pay for it all whilst they and their friends put millions into their pockets and they call it expenses. Meanwhile they send bailiffs to your house, they send debt collectors to your house, they change the rules, they impose regulations on you. The court's rules have changed now. If you want to challenge a contravention in the court, you now have to pay £75. Your right to challenge something which has been imposed upon you by the authorities that right has been taken away from you you now have to pay that's the system we're living under a stand and deliver system piracy on the public roads the roads taken away from us deliberately by the government on behalf of the local authorities and transport for london plc they themselves making millions for their directors. They go home smiling to their wives, have a comfortable sleep, whilst you await the 7.30 knock on your door by the crooked bailiffs, working on behalf of the government, the local authorities, and Transport for London. Now we have debt enforcement agencies now, and law enforcement agencies, they create all sorts of friendly approach to you to take your money. Don't trust them, ever. Do not trust these MPs, do not trust the local authorities. They're out to get you by the balls and they'll squeeze hard. Year upon year, your rights will be taken away from you because they put themselves into predicaments and they say they're right all the time. You are never right. You're always wrong. Ladies and gentlemen, you are being warned. You have been warned. Your time is now to stand up and fight for your right, your freedom of movement. You have that right to move around without being harassed by CCTV in London and in the UK. The government have promoted CCTV for themselves, using technology to their advantage. Now, in the police cars, they have fancy cameras where they can come behind you whilst you're driving, tap into the screens and voila, they will stop you for something else. Meanwhile, you, the little man on the street, you have to pay every penny. £404, which Transport for London wants, it will not see a penny because this will be fought to the highest court of the land and even to the European Court of Human Rights and the ECJ, European Court of Justice. Ladies and gentlemen, you have been warned. Stand up and fight for your rights. Don't leave it. Don't allow them to impose rules on you and they call it law. It is not law. It's what they see fit to take away your right and your money.